Invert Flicker Effect Drag Invert onto your clip In Effect Controls, set a keyframe at the beginning of your video and keep Blend with Original at 0 Go one frame ahead and set it to 100 Go another frame and set it to 0 And then go ahead and set it to 100 Now you just created this easy flicker effect for your edits You know what sucks? Crappy audio So let's fix that Click on your audio layer and head over to Essential Sound If you don't see it, go up to Windows and find Essential Sounds Next, click on Dialog, and then at the top, you will see Enhance Audio. Click on it, and use the slider to control the amount of enhancement. Make crappy audio like this. Ever felt like your videos are missing that wow factor? And make it sound better like this. Ever felt like your videos are missing that wow factor? Oh. Warp Stabilizer. Ever drink too much caffeine and got some shaky footage? <laughs> Type in Warp Stabilizer and drag it onto your video. Simply let it do its thing, and boom, now you got smooth footage. If it's a little too warpy, change the smoothness to 10, and change the method to scale, rotation, and position. Then go down to advanced, and click on detailed analysis. Now your shaky footage turns into smooth butter. Easy text animation. Once you made your text layers, type in transform and add it to your first text layer. In effects and controls, at the beginning, set the scale to 50 and add a keyframe. Go ahead 4 frames and set it to 100. Highlight the keyframes and right click and click ease in and then do it again and click ease out. Next click the drop down on the scale, grab the left keyframe and drag it about a quarter of the way to the right. On the left one drag it all the way to the left and then down. Next go down to the shutter angle and set it to 180. Right click on the transform and save it as a preset and now you can add it to all your text layers. Collation effect. Add channel blur to your video, and then over in effects controls, go down to red blurriness and set it to between 10 and 20. Next, add noise HLS auto and change the noise to green. Go down to the lightness and set it to 20. Now you created this easy retro halation effect. Subscribe for more videos and consider watching this video if you guys want to learn more cool effects.